Hi guys, welcome back to this channel. If it's your first time to come across this channel, consider subscribing. Don't forget to press the notification bell, you will be the first to know when I upload a new video. Yes, in today's video, we want us to look at something that is really criminal or something that can lead you problem, especially when you come as a security uh, guard in Qatar. Most of the times, we have different kind of shifts that we get to do, either morning shift or day shift. But remember, for example, if you're working night shift and uh, you probably have to be alert, is sleeping on duty is normally not allowed. And that is a very criminal offense, especially to, 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 to your supervisors. And this is exactly what is going to, to happen. In this video, I want to show you how exactly it is and how it's really. Because remember, if you are got sleeping on duty, it's just a salary deduction. It may depend on how much you are going to deduct or how much you are going to deduct on your salary. It will even depend on your company. And uh, some companies may, may, may even end up uh, uh, getting half of your salary. So this is, I have to let you know guys, wherever you are coming to do security in Qatar or you are coming to do security in these Gulf countries, what you need to be aware, especially if you are working night shift or you have your day shift as a night, uh, night shift, you need to make sure you have enough sleep such that when it comes to duty, you get alert. Yes, in this video, I'm trying to demonstrate to you and show you what are kind of those scenarios, what are the violations. The violations will depend, depending on your immediate supervisor in case you get or depending even on your company, uh, um, uh, company, company rules that you're supposed to follow. But remember, all in all, as a security guard, you're supposed to stay alert all the time, especially in... Uh, the night shift guard. Remember, one of one of the responsibility of one of the responsibility of the security guard would be taking care of the property or, or being alert as one of the requirements of it all. But in that case, if you are caught sleeping, if you are caught sleeping, it depends. I keep on telling you, it depends on what kind of scenario, what is your immediate supervisor at that time say, and uh, what kind of shift you get at the time. But I remember. All that I have to remind you that you definitely have what you call a penalty for that and you will definitely be penalized for you now being caught sleeping on duty because it is not allowed and it's not allowed to. I hope guys I've tried to share up something for you. I've tried to let you know how to do it and how you can and the only way how you can keep yourself alert is maybe by moving around not sitting in one play position uh, uh, trying to get yourself a little bit occupied uh, maybe um, uh, on your location it's the only way that can stop you sleeping from and even having enough rest in especially in your, your day off or having enough rest when you go back to prepare for your next shift and taking some more water it's one way so hope guys I've tried to share up something for you and I've tried to let you know show you what exactly and tell you what it could be but remember if you're caught sleeping then you definitely you'll get to lose something out of your salary or your salary will be cut by a given amount of figure because of sleeping on duty hope to see you again thank you so much for coming back to this channel don't forget to subscribe to this channel don't forget to support this channel and subscribe to this channel see you again as we try to look at another another video